hopefully flying to Orlando on a big family holiday. Um, there were loads of us, loads of kids as well. Uh, we got to the airport, checked in, a bit of chaos there, but it was okay. Uh, went to the gate, everything, got through to the gate, uh, and then we were held there. We didn't really get any information. Um, we were held for about two and a half hours at the gate. Uh, we heard there's a computer bug, and eventually uh, they told us to go out of the gate, unchecked us, uh, told us to go wait in departures. We waited there for about another three hours, and then we got called to a gate. We thought that we were going to be flying out at that point, even though we'd heard on the news that all the flights were cancelled. They didn't say that in the airport. So we went through to the gate, uh, and when we got there, we were just pushed out, pushed down a line, back to baggage reclaim, given a, like a piece of paper with our rights on it, and that was it. We couldn't talk to anyone, and we were kicked out of the airport, basically, uh, saying the flights can be refunded, and you get the basic uh, hotel and food allowance, but nothing about other flights or alternative arrangements at all. That was it. We had to try and rebook another airline. We were lucky enough to do that, so we're flying with Virgin today, um, but we are out of pocket for that. We were on our way to Heathrow, um, and we heard there was something from the news apps on our phone that was saying that there was some kind of disruption. But it wasn't until we actually got there that, um, that we, we heard our flights were cancelled. We didn't actually hear it from BA themselves. We were told by the news apps on our phone again, and BA staff, we felt really sorry for them. There was such a lack of communication. Nobody seemed to know what was going on. So um, we had to kind of try and figure out for ourselves what was happening for a few hours until somebody directed us to, to a hotel for, to, for, for last night. We tried to get in touch with them this morning. The phone lines are all, um, they, they keep cutting us off. So we haven't been able to get in touch with anybody to speak to. So we've just been relying on their Twitter, their website for information. Um, and we, we just, we, we want to have a nice time. So we, we couldn't wait any longer. So we've, we've just decided to, to kind of rearrange it. And it's been good, there's 10 of us. We, we've managed to do it, we're okay. We're probably not going to be going to Tallinn anytime soon. <laughs> so we've booked us as to um, an Airbnb in, in London. So we're going to have a London hen instead. So it's fine. <laughs>